Hi everyone, it's Lewis here. I've gone and parked my car in a stupid place again, so my chin's really bright, but the rest of my face isn't because I've got the sun visor up. Um, also, I was going to post a Facebook status about this, but I thought this while I was just watching the film, uh, Terminator Dark Fate. Why is it in America, um, people always leave the keys for their vehicle under the sun visor or in the glove compartment? Like, always. Why would you do that? Why would you leave your vehicle outside somewhere with the keys in it and it's unlocked? Like, every time that happens in movies, doesn't it? Every time. It kind of happened in this movie. Spoilers. But, yeah, um... Um, yeah, Terminator Dark Fate, which is, uh, as my friend Mike called it, Terminator 3, 4, because it's another one they've gone, we're going to scrap everything and just make a sequel to Terminator 2, which is fine, because, you know, who cares about all the other ones? Um, um, I, I, nah, it's meh. It's just every Terminator film's the same, isn't it? And I love Terminator 1 and 2, you know, I went to see them again at the cinema recently, and they're great. Hang on, it's really winding me up. Um... But Terminator is a great original story. And Terminator 2 is a great twist on that story. That's it. That's all you can do. Everything else has just been... Someone goes back in time, or a machine goes back in time to kill someone who's going to be important in the future, and then somebody else or another machine goes back to save them. That's that's it. That's all you can do with that story. And in this one, fair play, they, they try and make it different in the sense that it's not... <laughs> it's not the same, which is the definition of different, but you know what I mean. But at the same time, it is still the same. Um, I will say I liked Linda Hamilton coming back because she's fantastic. And, uh, yeah, and it was cool to see Sarah Connor again because they mugged her off in the other films, really. Um, and she's, you know, she's great and it's nice to see her back. She, she's a very good character and Linda Hamilton is like great at that. Um, um, but I really like the new cast, and I'd rather it just been about them. Um, I think it's Mackenzie Davis that plays Grace, who's kind of a human who's enhanced and stuff. Um, and she was really good. Uh, I can't remember the name of the girl. I think it's Natalie Reyes, I think her name is. She's like the main girl who people are trying to kill and save because she's important in the future, um, etc. She was good. And the new Terminator guy, played by Gabriel Luna, who's like a Terminator, but more um, like they all are, Um yeah, he was good as well. So I'd rather it just been about them. And, and I thought I'd never say this, but I'd rather Arnold just not have been in it, which is like, you know, like, you know, it's Terminator. He kind of has to be there apart from that one that he was only in briefly. And I'd rather he just made a cameo in this one because he didn't really add anything to it. It was just kind of like, you know, he's there because he's there. Um, but yeah, I mean, it started off really good and I was like, oh, this is quite good. There's no messing around. They're getting, they're cracking on with it. The action's quite exciting. But then as it went on, I just, it kind of gradually lost me a bit more and I was just kind of like, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm good with this now. Um, so there's nothing bad about it. It's just, you know, it's the same story. I'd rather it just been set in the Terminator universe. Linda Hamilton's fine, little appearance from her and maybe like, you know, a little cameo from Arnold. And then, um, it just be focused on the newer people because they were cool. I like them. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you're a Terminator fan, there's enough there to, see they don't overdo it on references to the old stuff and they don't have all the catchphrases in you know there's little kind of allusions to it but not not too much um but yeah so i mean it's okay it's enjoyable enough um but yeah it's just it's just the same thing isn't it just stop now if i want to watch terminator i'll go and watch the other the first two it's fine just leave it alone james cameron go and make avatar 6 or whatever but yeah anyway thanks